Hi Sagittarius, welcome to this Twin Flame Tower Love Reading. My name's Sophia, welcome back or welcome if you're new. Um, I think Sagittarius, Jupiter. Jupiter, your person, your spouse is in Sagittarius at the moment. So you're probably having a, 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 a pull definitely towards your person. Um, that's about, um, Jupiter is um, the sacral chakra which is why it's connected with your uh, masculine, which is your person doesn't matter if the masculine or feminine. And Jupiter is to do with um, growth and expansion, understanding. So there may have been an off for you to have to think about that. Um, um, it's also to do with sexuality and creativity. So it's um, if you've had an off at the moment, um this might be more about you getting into mission and, and pulling back sexually so that this can push things forward with your person let's see what go, what the cards say what's this connected and i'll do a bit more dots with the jupiter in your star sign at the moment <laughs> it's de uh, definitely something's getting pushed forward i'm picking up so let's do this what's going on with saji with your person more so than you <laughs> well you you're still going forward but there's something that's um so i'll see what's happened because of, it's jupiter which is your spouse so something's happened with your spouse which i'm picking up the, the channeled message is it's moving forward yeah look the world card here or will I can see this, so I'm going to take it. Okay. Let's turn that over. That was three. So let's see what's happened. The choices, seven of cups, first one. So this is, to me, is about... I don't know how... <laughs> Breathe, breathe. This is about you emotionally investing, going within and tapping into the planetary systems that are outside, which will connect on the higher plane. When you do that, you get communication, right, which stops the confusion with the Seven of Cups, and then you won't look at anything as being decep decep de deception, deceptful, lies. <laughs> When he's chatting shit, in other words, it won't bother you so much. You have to do this, connect with the planetary system. So first one here is the sun. Um, I won't go for all of them. If you don't do this, this is what this reading is saying. That's why it goes so slow. I don't know how many times I have to say it. You have to go within. By going within, you connect with the higher realms and they sort it out for you. You are, it's like a contradiction. I always go in longer with the first card. If you don't go within, it's like, well, you lot, that you don't trust the sky. The sky is everywhere. So the sky is everything, right? Which is God, whatever you want to call it. Upstairs, I call it, right? You think you, tiny little you on this earthly, lower energetic frequency plane can know better than upstairs. So that's why you get shit. If you give it up to them and say, look, I trust you, yeah, how you do that is going within, because going within connects with all the planetaries, as within, so without, as above, so below, then they communicate to you what to do to stop making this go slow. So either you're doing that or you need to do that. Your person is back and forth juggling here. This is the um, <coughs> the, the Lammas gates to me. Look, you got the two, two of pentacles here. Two of Pentacles here. This is him. When you do that, what I've just stated, he leans towards you. So at the moment, like I said, with the Jupiter going on at the moment in the uh, in your star sign, which is your person, he's leaning towards you. So I'm going to see why. But at the same time, there's a Lamaskate here, which the infinite eight symbol goes around that, you know, that Lamaskate and that one here. So if your person is in two homes, let's call it, it's not living with you, right? She's not living with you. 
both situations they feel compelled to stay. This is what you need to understand. For you to understand that, you need to go within. Because of the pull towards your person is so intense. The only way you can have understanding without being on the lower energetic of the frequency of the earthly plane is to go in and then allow them to communicate to you so you have understanding of how he goes back and forth from this situation. Because to you, you might think, oh, what's he doing over there? What's she doing over there? Shit. Oh, he don't really love her or she don't love him or whatever over there. Or, you know, they're taking a piss out of him. Whatever the scenario is over there. It doesn't matter. The lamaskate is over there. The lamaskate is over there. Your person still feels compelled to go back and forth. But leaning towards you because of something's happened at the moment. Well, I'll tell you what's happened. is because they loves you. She loves you. So there's a hot and cold situation going on at the moment, I'm feeling, which, like I said, was talking about the uh, Lamascape. That's the Lamascape to me. Can you see the yin and yang? And here's you, the, the high priestess, with the moon and the waxing moon. Can you see kind of like that there? That's what the high priestess. So this is you. This is your person trying to balance the back and forth. But if you show the light with this one, you influence his choices by you going in. No fucking words needed. I don't know how many times I say this. You go within. This is seven of cups, which is choices or addictions. So your person could be addicted to that home life. Could be addicted to drugs, literally, over there because his situation is crap right but this to me is more the first card the seven of cups is more to do with you going within you shedding the light because there's love there there's no mistaking there's love here right you your person loves you and you love your person twin flame right so he leans towards you when you go within and that shows the light because within the yin and the yang you are the light you are the light worker it's fuck all to do with words the yin and yang it doesn't say yang and chat does it it doesn't say anything about that. Yin is the light. You just have to shed the light. Well, you go within to the darkness with the moon, which is the deception, because he don't want you to know that he feels compelled to stay there until you do all the work. Then that compelled goes. But this isn't, to me, this isn't, this isn't early thoughts. So you're either new or you're just not listening. It's one of those. You're not understand. No. It's not understanding, they correct me. You're not listening. You're not listening. That's your choice, but you're still not listening, so the delay is you. Always you. There's an understanding of the yin and the yang. There's an understanding of the high priestess, but you're not taking the action. That's what's going on on this one here. Hence, I said Jupiter's in yours at the moment, which means expansion and understanding and abundance. Abundance in love your choice it's his first card choices you're going to make the choice you always say it's his choice never never that your choice you're the leader you go with him then they come towards look he's leaning towards you for fuck's sake he's leaning towards you but you want you want him to just come to cut that off that's selfish that's you wanting. What, what's wrong with him just coming and seeing you? What's wrong with that? If you just carried on being cool and that person just came, him or her just came and see you, you think he will stay there. Once you start giving it that, then they go back over there. That's how it rolls. Underneath this, look, you push this wall forward, wheel of fortune, abundance. It's something to do with money. I'll check that out as well. So your money... Your person might be staying over there, something to do with finances. Either he's financially connected, the mortgage, or something like that. Because if I'm feeling picking up money, there's money here as well. So, yeah, he doesn't feel he can come towards you because he hasn't got enough savings. Maybe he, the addiction is he overspends. There's something which I'm picking up to do with money here as well because this is the Wheel of Fortune. But, look, it's like you control this on top of there. You either be the monkey with the monkey mind. Oh, he's not leaving. Oh, he's not doing this. And all these thought, thought, thoughts, which you don't have to think about jack shit. You just trust and go within, which I've said on the first card. 
don't need to think about it. You just go within. When each Ted is showing up, if it doesn't go against your boundaries and you're free, you meet him. That's it. If you can work it out or juggle things around to meet your person, meet them. Then, all right, see you later. I guarantee that's all I've done. Should I ask my person, what is he doing over there? Yeah, casually in, you know, eat conversation, how are you, what are you up to? But no deep jack shit, nothing. All right, see you soon. That's it. That's it. If I ask him, which I hardly do, when, do I, when am I going to see you? I give him the choice. This is not choice. This is monkey mind telling, oh, well, I'm free this Saturday. What are you doing? Then he commits and says yes, knowing that he's got another commitment with this other eight lambman skate, and then you'll like that to him or her. That's what's going on here. This is you, like I said. It's um, expansion. Your choices. It's your choice. This is... If you understand and you go within, you push this wall forward and you stop with this monkey mind of thinking what to do and go within because the monkey's blinded. So you just go within and be the high priestess. All within, like I said, with the choices, right? This will be a new restart. Because I said there's something about your person because underneath the full card, there's a re restart. Which your full card is about him going into... Look, he's putting... You see this? If you ignore the shit that he says or whatever, you know, going on with your person, right? If you just ignore that. And people say, well, they're saying to change your word, but you know I can't think of another word. Let me think. All right, let it slide. <laughs> Same thing. <laughs> I don't like to use ignore because ignore sounds like ignorance, right? If you just carry on and don't worry about it right whatever goes on right knowing that you have a choice to go within which will calm you down and push this forward instead of it going so slow then what happens is your person does the same thing he has a restart he puts the deception look treads on it which is on the high priestess she has her foot on the moon as well the, the connection between the high priestess and the full card is for you understanding that it's not that your person is lying. It's so that you understand that some people say things to protect themselves, which is lies in itself. It doesn't mean that they're intentionally meaning to hurt you. When you pick that up and you make it a big deal, all you're doing is making the situation worse. I'll give you an example. If I, um, if someone said to me, would you like to, before, before, I was, before when I was worried about pronouncing and my dyslexic and stuff, would you like to come and do a, a, um, a presentation in, in a college, university or some shit like this? I'm just making it up, right? And, you know, it'd be an honor or something like that. You get loads of money. And then, um, I felt awkward because I didn't want to talk in public because I mess up my words. So I said, no, I'm sorry, I'm busy that day. Then that person found out that I was busy that day, but knew I was dyslexic, right? Because you know your twin flame shit hits the fan. You know that. You know with the high, there's a low, right? Well, if you don't, you should. If you're new, please check out my playlist, right? So you know there's some deception, right so instead of doing the dots oh yeah she's dyslexic maybe she didn't want to say that i know her situation what you do is call me out and say well why weren't you there you lied you said you was away would i talk to you wouldn't it be awkward wouldn't aren't you making the situation worse you need to understand the situation they lie i would have lied saying i didn't want to do that but for another reason yes i might have lied to the person but a reason twin flames lie for a fucking reason if you pull up the deception this won't go forward if you just let it slide i don't know how else to say it the deception hence the high priestess puts the moon at the bottom of her feet the full card that then starts a restart with your person because then he stops lying to you because they trust that you are cool when they say stuff to you. Then they open up more. Otherwise, they won't. 
this is what this is going on with the Jupiter. So it's a restart for your person. So some of you might have um, literally not said nothing. So there's a restart. Or you've said something to push it forward. Or you've pulled back. That's the only other way you do it. You said something, but you've gone. But it's, it's, it's there's, there's something to do with, this is a bit of in and out I'm feeling. It's a new start, but you stabbed your person in the back. I need to get some clarity on this because this is in and out. Because at the end of the day, whatever you said, there's something was said here, something that was said to, for some of you, which may have ended your person's Oh, okay, I get it. Sorry, I'm tapping in. So the restart is now going to be your person listening to you as a page. So, okay, so there's two things that's happened here. So either you, like, you've said something and you've pulled back, good, or you've put your foot on the deception and just ignored. So there must have been an off. Because your person's leaning towards you. Because normally there's an off for you to do that. <laughs> normally most don't just do what I do. And just ignore what's going on with their person. Normally an off situation. You don't have to have the off. <laughs> you don't have to. If you just. It will come naturally. And they will tell you. But there might have been. Like I said. There was a timeline now. Which you felt was the time to say. Oh okay. I've got to say this. I've got to say that. And then you've pulled back. If you do that constantly without going within, it won't work. If you don't keep going within after you've done this, this will go back because the full card is here. The zero is here. So even though the full card is a good card, but it's a zero and there's a wheel next to it. So this is the Lama escape. This is a zero and this is a zero. So you, in essence, more so are shedding the light on your person to go towards you but he's going to show up as a page pre-warning so it's ended the te the the stab in the back for both of you because it's the lover's card here so you might have felt stabbed in the back but he does as well this is what you lot don't understand it's like when you was getting um not you personally like someone is living with someone who beats them up you don't understand why they stay in that relationship with someone beating them up. It's the same with your person. You don't need to know. They do things for that reason. So you have to understand it. Do you see what I mean? And just love them when they come towards you. That's it. So if you've said something and you've gone within the correct way, then you've done the right thing for the choices at this moment but the pre-warning on this is that it's a zero and the will and the monkey mind is on top of this will <laughs> so don't let it go back is a pre-warning and your person's going to show up the last card as a page this is him a fool is someone who doesn't know so it's a restart and your person's going to Turn up as a page, look, with the twin flame, because he, he, he heard you. There's a third party here, but he heard you. He's looking at you, he heard you. So whatever was said, he's heard, which has ended the, 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 the stab in the back. So let me get some things. Cause that's a, so I might be hitting a couple of groups here. So some of you have to literally do that, if you understand that. Understand when they're saying things that are, which hurt you and you know he's lying to either, yeah, you can pull back if you go within. If you're not going within, it normally falls back is what they're telling me. So, may, or, or, okay, so if you've said something to your person, right, and you're working within, fine. Keep working within. When they show up, right because they've heard you if you don't keep on going within it's going to go back to the zero point that's it 
there's two one two three lamaskates i can see in this reading i'm not going to go over it which lamaskate is the strength card the lamaskate is the magician card so the lamaskate the figure eight with the yin and yang let's just say is about um you sh you constantly shed in the light you all you are the high priestess you move this forward you have the choice but you have to go within. You have to go within. So it's a pre-warning of either you do that or if you've done that, make sure you keep going within when they come back because they hear you. Because it will go, I promise you, it will go back. So that's what's going on here. Sorry, it's a bit long because I couldn't get... Yeah, because there's... It, oh, so there's interference. Let me get... Who's that from? So he's going back to the funkiness now. Uh, who's this? <coughs> Our interference for the twin flame, which needs to be balanced, okay, <coughs> with the temperance there. Let me see, what's going on here? And um, then it will be a completion. So there might be a pause now. This one, the Eight of Swords. Interference, see? This is other people. This is both of you. You always think it's them. It's both of you. There's interference. It's both of you. Unless you totally, like, cut off yourself from the world, say, like me, then you know it's your person. Because <laughs> I have no interference. No one tells me. Well, upstairs, and I obviously trust them. <laughs> but otherwise, it's other people's interference, which is well, why it's not, um, why it hasn't been moving forward. Because this is six of swords. One, two, three, four, five, six. Let's separate that. It hasn't been moving forward, so there's been heartbreak. Three of swords, three of swords. Because you both haven't been in your truth. And you're the leader. What is the truth? Have you been going within? <laughs> Hence I say, you are the delay. You, you, you. It's even here in this card. The delay of love is that. You, you, you. Because you're not going within... Within is the tree of life. That's why that thing is on the tree. I can't pronounce it because you think, why is she saying that thing? Um, but, so there's a delay here. Why the wheel turns, let's just say, that then uh, there's a new beginning. He's going to leave the snake and all that behind him. Look, the money. I said there's something to do with money here. Look. So it's going to be a restart with sorting out his money, which is going to end this stab in the back, this three of swords, and then because he, he's listening to you. And can you see, he might be listening, but he's looking up. That's higher consciousness. And this is, I'm not going to go into the full card. I've got two full cards in my Twin Flame Tarot card playlist. Another wheel. Be careful. I'm just going to say this. With all these wills and that, be careful. Will, you know a will, a will on a car, a will goes forward, goes back or stays still. The choice is yours. If you come off from what you're doing now to push it forward because he shows up, all right, I heard you. She shows up, all right, I heard you. I've ended the burden and you go back to before, that will will go back. Hence why it's always... Um, always con continuing because of um you think it's just going to come to you now move in with you let's get ring let's get married let's have the kids no it's a page so that's a pre-warning sorry this is long but there's so many wills and shit let's see what's going on Oh, what's these? They're talking about that. See, Aries. So let's go with what's going on with Aries. Aries is um, first house, self, you. Work on yourself, green, love yourself. What's that one? Is that, that's not, um, that's Venus. Yeah, work on yourself and love yourself. That will balance it out and it needs balance for this. I don't know how many times I've got to say, go within. That's what that says, go within. If you don't keep going within, it's going to go back. Some people need so much pain before they actually listen. That's how it is. <laughs> That's why I'm not going to 
all I'm going to do is keep telling you guys. Go with it. If you want a shortcut to union, just listen. <laughs> I don't know how else to say it. Last card, what's going on? Oh, it's this one. What is this one? Oh, no. It's not good. Oh, gosh. Okay. Here's what's the situation. <sighs> See, I said that's why I'm in and out. I'm in and out. I'm always like that, and particularly in my tower readings. If I'm back and forth, in and out, and it's not straightforward, you're not. I'm picking up your energy, right? So it's like you're in and out. So you're worried about what's going on. So there's something happened that you're worried about. You're also, this is, look, false person, it's you. Now, I'm not saying you're deceptive, you're lying and stuff like that. But if your person lies, you lie because you're not going in and doing the work. So you're lying to upstairs. So they're just going to, it's like a pre-warning once again. And it's the eight. The eight to me represents you're not communicating properly from up above. That's why I'm confused. It's like this reading is like, look, this is how it will go. There's something that's happened with Jupiter in Sagittarius at the moment, right? That is um, pushing this forward. But who makes the choice is you. So if you don't complete this or if you're halfway or you won't do it, you don't remove your mask and get into this, it's going to go back. That's what I'm saying. The false person is you. Your person's in the background. It's you. It's you. You're, you're treating this. Look, it's red. This is fucking third dimension. This is soulmate card. Why do I say that? Red is, that's what they have on television. Red hearts, pink hearts. If this was spirituality life, this would be green. The heart is green. This is someone treating this like a soulmate and kidding themselves that they're going to go in. Or done a bit of gone in. What upstairs does is like, okay, she's doing the work. He's doing the work. We'll push it forward, right? So he's hearing you. He's dropping his burdens. But then you're like, oh, okay, he's shown up now. So you go back. Then they pull back. That's a false mask. It's a pre-warning, this reading. This is what I'm telling you. Why is he over there? Why is he over there? Why don't he come towards me? Blah, 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 blah. Because he gets in despair that he will turn up when your door's skin. That could be a reality. That could be, yeah, I'm fine. He's sorted over there. Just how you're stubborn as fuck and you're not going within and doing what I'm saying, so is he. So you're the light. To come out of your stubborn ways and do what that is your contract as a twin flame to do, which is to go within, right, and connect with higher consciousness and remove your mask, hence the eight, then he will come out of that. That's how it goes. This one come out first. That's what I'm saying. He, you might say, well, why is he doing that? I'm saying this could be an example of what he really generally feels in despair if i just left and went with her now so i'm quite happy over here he or she you don't know that you think he's going to tell you that well i'm not coming towards you because i'm going to be skin because i guarantee you because no i'll look after you no i'll get you a job no i'll do that he's a fucking man he don't want you to do anything for him any masculine that is their role they don't want you to do jack shit, and it's not for you to do jack shit. I just released a video about that. It's all about oneself. It's not about any other. Oneself. You love oneself. Then it will be completion. That's all green. That's what I'm saying. That's the heart chakra. That's the soulmate. That's how you're carrying on for some of you. You want it to complete. You go within and love yourself. For the twin flame. I think this is, what is this? Fourth ones, yeah. Then it will be a stable foundation. But I pre-warn you, it's not he's going to come move in with you. If they do that, then you're soulmate. <laughs> That's it. That's it. That's how I always say, everyone says, oh, is it my person? Is it my person? Tell me the situation. Oh, he's over there doing da da da. Well, it's your person. If you've got a bling on it or you've moved in or you're pregnant and that, you've either got someone who you've manipulated to have a kid and get married and they run, they always leave, 
Or if they're over there doing stuff and you know you're the twin flame and you think they're the twin flame, you only think that because you're not doing the work, then they're in their perfection of a role because you ain't going within. So all I will say is go within. And this is long. I'm going to cut you out here. So um, if you're new, please check out both my playlists. If you've got you booked me and you're struggling, book David. He's available now. Um, and he gets booked out quickly. So you can take a couple, I think. I can't remember. I'll ask him in a bit. And um, basically, everything on my website to get in union with yourself and get with your person needs to be booked. Uh, your choice to be booked. Correction. But everything on my website is what i done to get into union. So hopefully this has been good for you and speak to you later.